multi pack. This is a multi pack. This is a multi pack. That's the most ugliest thumbnail that would ever be on YouTube. But. <laughs> everybody welcome back to my channel um so as you can see i'm very very fresh faced got no makeup on so i want to bring out all of the lashes that i love where i get them from um i'm even going to do a little try on for you guys to show you exactly how i put my lashes on and how they stay on all day i'm going to do my full face off camera apart from my lashes and then i'm going to come back and I will be showing you how I apply my lashes. Hey everybody, I'm back with my full face. I just did a simple glam. <laughs> she says simple and she literally beats her face. So I just did a very simple eye because I want the focus to be on the lashes today. Um, and as you can see, I actually tried something new with my makeup. I'll give you five seconds to guess. Okay, I was just going to tell you. I did blush. Can you tell? I put blush on smile, my smile. I'm really liking it. It's very subtle. Very subtle. It's a rimmel one. First things first, I want to show you the lashes that I absolutely live by. They are the 3D47 lashes, which you can purchase from eBay, AliExpress, Amazon, Wish, Shein. Freshly bought, coming out the packet. More. Okay, they look like this. Now do you understand why I'm so obsessed with them? Like, they're the perfect distance apart. They're so wispy and fluttery. They're a very nice length as well. Um, and what I'm going to do is I will show you exactly how I wear these lashes. First thing that I recommend you do is just take it out of the packet um, and then just line it up to your eye. Okay, and I personally think that your lashes should be slightly shorter than your actual eye shape. I feel like the three quarters of your eye, your eyelid. Um, so just grab a pair of scissors. Okay, so I've got the scissors and I've got my lash. And what you can see is from this eyelash, it goes shorter towards the inner corner and like bigger towards the outer corner. So what you want to do is you want to trim it from the outer, so the part that's a bit bigger, which is here. So I'm just going to trim that, like that. So as you can see, that's literally going to be perfect for my eye shape now. I have very strong opinions when it comes to glue. I'm very particular, and the glue that I 1000 million percent recommend, which I'm sure every other beauty, beauty guru would recommend, is the Duo Lash Glue. Just the absolute original bare bones Duo Lash Glue. This one is white clear strip lash adhesive. I have another glue which is the duo lash glue fast adhesive. Do not buy this. You will not be able to get this off your eyelashes for about two days. Honestly. And it's so annoying because... Oh that's what it's called. Quick set. Quick set. Don't buy it. Don't buy it. Just please don't. Just please. The moral of that story is that I did wear that lash glue in my blue eye makeup tutorial and you will notice halfway through the video I see a little white thing on my eyelash and it's that glue. It's that glue from two days before I filmed that video which is disgusting. So um, the ones that you get in like eye lore packets and stuff like the ones that you get just in these individual kind of sets of lashes that glue is actually really really good. Cutting the other one Okay, so now they're both cut. Just take it out. What I do is I don't actually apply it straight onto my lash. I put it onto a surface. I get any device like a bobby pin or a like a safety fastening pin. What I don't even know what they're called. The ones that you use to fasten saris and stuff. You can use one of them. Or you can use your trusty Primark glue because it comes with a really good wand. Apply it all the way. And what you want to do is put a very, very generous amount on the inner and the outer corners. 
Let that get tacky for about two minutes. While I'm waiting for this to dry, I'm going to put mascara on. So every time I put fake lashes on, I always put mascara on before. When you wear mascara, it kind of curls them upwards. So that means that it naturally starts to blend in with the fake lashes. Real certified G's in the building. Let me get that, let me get that. Okay guys, that's all probably dried enough by now. So I usually just apply these with my hand, to be honest. I'm gonna zoom in so you can see it properly. I just literally put it right in the middle, okay? And then I begin to adjust it. So move that closer to the inner corner, move that into the outer corner and you're pretty much done. Obviously you can adjust it a bit more in terms of making sure the lash band is right next to your real lashes like that. Okay, and now can you see why it's important to let it go tacky, otherwise that will just slip and slide all over the place. So that's on. So just do the same technique. Look how much nicer your makeup looks when you wear false lashes. Oh, I'm obsessed. This step aims to blend your false lashes with your real ones and really kind of merge them together um, to give you that kind of flawless effect. So just look down, put them all the way and just squeeze it. I've got my liquid liner by NYX and all you have to do is literally just look down and just go over your the lash band to conceal it. I personally hate wings, so I'm not doing a wing. But all you want to do is literally just make sure you can conceal that whole lash band so that when you look down, there's absolutely no white glue. So now I want to kind of show you some other lash options. I obviously love the 3D47 and now you know why. Oh, this could be my thumbnail, okay. That's the most ugliest thumbnail that would ever be on YouTube. But, <laughs> okay, here are some other ones. These are from eBay. And all they are is just a, all I type in is multi-pack lashes, big false lashes, Big lashes multi pack. Five minutes later. Sets of lashes. Wispy black lashes. Just be aware that you will probably have to trim them. So, yeah, these are gorgeous. Other ones that I've got are these. Um, and these ones, I love those ones because they go really thin in, the, in there and then they go really thick. Those, the ones that go thin and then really thick are perfect. So you can go for the actual brands as well. So you can go for like Eyelaw is a really good one, um, Ardell Wispy, um, Roman and Rhea, they really like uh, Cherry Red. I think that's what it's called. It's either Cherry Red or Red Cherry Lashes. They love those, that brand. Like my first ever video, I wore Tatty Lashes and they were stunning. Um, and what you might notice is it says 3D Foam Ink. Uh, if you're vegan or you care a lot about, you know, where your products come from, get the ones that are Foam Ink because mink um, is very, very cruel and it's just animal cruelty. So if you get mink lashes, you know, you're not, you're not really kind of being ethical with your choices in a way. But obviously each to their own, like... You may want to get mink for the quality, like it's completely up to you, but I personally try and just get the faux mink, because um, I think it just works just as well, to be honest. And obviously, like I was explaining about eye law, and what I've noticed with um, branded lashes is that they're very reusable, so you can keep using them again and again. With these 3D47, I probably reuse them about three times, but with the kind of like tatty lashes, the Ardell, um, those kind of ones, I probably do reuse them about seven or eight times. If I try to like consider price points, these 3D47s were two pounds, okay, and you get a pack of five. Obviously, reusability, like you can use them like three, four times. I'd literally say like six times max if you want to, like you can. Uh, the Tatty Lashes, these were 9 99 just for literally a set of one. But like I said, extremely high quality. 
I want to talk about one multi-pack that I got from Amazon. I got a multi-pack of 10 lashes and they came in this. As you can see, there's only two standing. I've used them all. They came as a 10 pack in this and it was about 9.99. Um, and all of them came individually. Obviously, you do have to trim them. I also got these from eBay. Um, and these are amazing too. But they are a little OTT. Um, and when you wear them, you will look very extra. Like, very extra. But they are nice. Like, these ones, for example, are huge. And then, obviously, like, these are a little bit more subtle. I say subtle, but subtle for me, okay? Obviously, like, I've shown a lot of multi-packs. So this is a multi-pack. This is a multi-pack. This is a multi-pack. But you can also get individuals from all of these different, like, Amazon, AliExpress. Th these I got from AliExpress. Um, these were about three or four pounds just for a set of one. But I really recommend them because when you just buy a set of one, usually the quality is really good and the reusability is really good. So, and also if you actually don't wear lashes very often, uh, you might just want to get a set of one anyway. Like you don't need a big fat multi pack, like why would you need that? So yeah, just look around, just browse around and obviously you will be taking a risk because when you're buying off of like Amazon and eBay and stuff, you never know what it's really going to look like when it comes. I also would recommend you going around Primark. Primark has really nice lashes actually, very good ones. They're only a pound as well. There's a They're a pound for one set, so it's worth checking out Primark. But yeah guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm just gonna give you one more close up. But I will see you in my next video and I hope that you did like this and you give it a big thumbs up and you subscribe and share and all of that stuff because it'd be amazing for me to be able to inspire others with my passion for lashes. So thank you for watching and I will catch you in the next video. No, I, I'm just trying to hit, I be coming, no.